everyone, happy new year. In this video, I want to show you how the Google Translate IDX app works. And it basically does what the title says. It helps you translate your IDX pages automatically, and you just need to set up this app on your IDX pages. So you can find it on IDX add-ons, just search for Google Translate IDX and you'll find it. Um, and the first thing you would need to do is to turn the service on. You can turn it off or on, toggle the button at any time you'd like. And then you would select the languages that you like um, to have available. I'm going to be showing you an example here. So we have English, Spanish, and Portuguese on this website. This is a website that sells real estate in Miami. So it might be good for them to have the Spanish language on IDX Broker. So in this case, um, I chose for this test Spanish and Portuguese. And then if we click on show advanced settings, if we turn this on, it could detect that the browser is in Spanish and translated automatically. And then we have a delay. We have to have a number here, but this is um, the milliseconds it would take for the translation to occur. And then after that, I'm not going to toggle this button and I'm going to keep this delay as is. I will click on save settings. And all I have to do is copy this code and then I'm gonna go here in tutorial to see where I need to place it. And it tells me to go to the IDX broker subheaders section. So I'm here and we need to add it to the global section and click on save. It's also very important to go to the categories and pages sections. If we have a letter in any of these, so like a P or a C or an S, we need to make sure to add in the code there. So if we had a P here and we want to translate the map search, we click on this, copy the code again, save the changes. This is so that it works on these pages that have extra coding. In this case, none of these have extra coding, so we won't be adding um, anything there. And if we add it in this global section, what it would do is that it would translate all of the IDX pages. If you just want to translate some of them, you can go to the specific ones here. So just add it in results and not in global, um, just in featured. Um, you can add it to two of them, three of them, etc. In this case, I'm going to be translating everything and click on save. So as I mentioned, this website is part of the Miami Associations of Realtors. This is Miami USA. This is the website that they have. And now I'm going to click on search homes. And here we see the little um, translate option. So let's test it out. This is the map search. So if we click on Spanish, it takes the um, 1500 milliseconds and then translates everything to Spanish, including the tags. Um, the box over here, everything is now in Spanish as well as the properties. It's important to mention that it only translates what's on the page. So if you load new properties, um, those might not be translated and you need to run the translate again. Um, same thing for Portuguese. And then if we click on this button, it takes us back to English, which is the original. This takes us back to Portuguese. Um, if we click on a basic search over here and click on Spanish, we can also translate this and then make a search and we can translate this to Portuguese. So yes, the Google Translate widget is very, very useful and it really helps you to have this automatic. So this way you open up the possibilities of selling properties to people that speak multiple languages, not just English, um, which is the default language. And you don't have to do any extra coding for it to work. Um, just adding it to the subheader section and our widget does everything automatically. You can add in the languages that you'd like. It can only be one, two, three however you want, and the dropdown will be modified. You can get this app for free by being a Realty County client. You just need an IDX broker account and go to realtycounty.com slash free and click on any of these to send an email to IDX broker so that they make the switch and that you become a Realty County client.